Happy 4th of July, everybody. This is Andrew Roboto here, and today I'm going to switch it up for the commentary slash reaction videos. This time we're going to do them on a new series that Matt the Go Animator is doing. It's called the Childish Teenager series. Now, similar to Childish Dad, it involves the main, the main protagonist being childish despite him being a Despite, um, okay, despite him being too old to throw tantrums, that's the better word I can say. I'm sorry I messed up there. But anyways, for those who don't know, um, Childish Teenager is about a teenager named Al Alan who is 16 years old and throws tantrums. Just like how Dave is 35 years old and throws tantrums. However, for Dave, there's a backstory why he did that, because his his mother accidentally dropped him on his head when he was a baby, and that slowed down his brain development. For Alan, we don't have a backstory yet. And who knows what we'll, what the backstory is going to be behind that. But we'll find out eventually. And in this series, he has a brother named Tony, who's 13 years old, and is far more mature than a 16-year-old like him. And they obviously live with their mother. So yeah, so that's pretty much how the series is. And the first video I'm going to be reacting to in the Childish Teenager series is going to be the debut video, which is the very first one Matt the Go Animator did. Just like with Childish Dad, the first video I'm going to react to for Childish Teenager is um, Childish Teenager Doesn't Want to Eat a Salad. So without further ado, let's start the video and see how funny it is. And I'm going to react to a couple of these in weeks' times, just like with the Childish Dad videos. Alan, what's wrong right now? Dinner isn't going to be ready for another 10 to 15 minutes. I don't want to eat salad. I'd rather eat hamburgers instead. Salads are good for you. Hamburger instead of the silly salad. Salads are good for you. You should eat a salad. Come on, Alan. I've been in the kitchen making dinner. They're healthy. I'm going to be having chicken and mashed potatoes. Chicken and mashed potatoes are good, I too. Making you a I love dinner. chicken. We can have those another time. Can't you at least eat some of your salad before we have dinner? No, I do not like salads, and that is final. Salads are they good are for you. They're, they're good. Sorry. I love uh, salads. But there is no way I'm eating a silly, silly salad. Silly, can silly salad. <laughs> You're starting to act childish like you always do. Clearly, he is Sounds acting childish. Sorry, this pops up. I don't know why this thing pops up, but I apologize. Tony is 13 years old, and he's not complaining about eating salads before dinner. Exactly, he In isn't. Fact, he eats his salads every single day. Mom, why is it yeah, that I eat, doesn't want to eat his salad? I eat salad every day, too. Salad's good for you. Do what your brother does. Salads are really good. And healthy. I have to agree with Tony. Because Tony, Alan, I I agree with you, Tony. Salads are good for you. You should eat them. Alan is a big baby. He acts like he clearly is a big baby. <laughs> oh, here comes the tantrums. <laughs> I am the child. How could you call me that? The I'm that childish. Is, How I could? You force me to eat my salad when I want I'm to that childish. How would you? <laughs> For crying out loud, Alan. Stop being so ridiculous. No <laughs> one is forcing you to eat your salad. Mom is asking you to eat your salad before dinner is ready. That's all she is doing. Besides, with your childish behavior, this is already getting embarrassing. Exactly, it is getting embarrassing. I agree with Tony. You're embarrassing like Davis. <laughs> You're embarrassing everyone in the family, including yourself. You need to stop this childish behavior for once and eat your salad. <laughs> He's dancing while throwing a tantrum. I make me a hamburger, make me a hamburger. I don't want this silly salad. Silly salad, nice. Sorry, I hit the camera by accident. I do apologize. LOL, by the way. <laughs> I'll give you one chance to behave yourself. And then you will be grounded for a week, and you will not be getting dessert after dinner. <laughs> well, do you understand me? 
I don't want a salad. 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 Oh my god. These videos are just as funny as childish dad. These are just as funny. Salad. I want you to order me a double bacon cheeseburger from Carl's Jr. Absolutely. No. Now sit back down and eat your salad or you will be grounded. Remember what I just said? Wow. Well, he's crying like a lawnmower. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, he just shoved his dinner plate off the table. That's it. Alan, I can't believe you threw your salad onto the floor instead of eating it like everyone else is doing. You are grounded for a week. And you will not be getting dessert after dinner. Now go upstairs to your room, and I will bring you your dinner when it's ready. Don't ground me, don't ground. Don't me ground me, don't ground me. Me don't ground me, don't ground. Yeah, you're a big baby. Me don't ground me, don't ground me, don't ground me. You entitled Catherine. Don't entitled Catherine. Big time. Such a big baby. I can ground you, and I have. Now, go to your room. No. I said go to your room. I said no. Go to your room now. For the one millionth time, no. You know what? I have no choice but to carry you upstairs to your oh, room. Since you won't listen to me. He's gonna get carried. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> What a baby. <laughs> I love the running gag where they get picked, where the child, where the person that's childish gets picked up in the end and carried to their room. I love that. I love that running gag. It's so funny. <laughs> Clearly he is a big baby. Hopefully he does act his own age. I agree with you. Now, let's finish our salads. All right, interesting video and funny at the same time. Okay, so I'm going to react to them in chronological order, like by the latest it was released. Hang on, I got to I forgot to get this this at full screen. I do apologize. Um, okay, so next video I'm going to react to is childish teenager misbehaves at the mall. Ignore the ad. I hate when these pop up on YouTube when I'm about to watch a really funny video. Stay off the freeway. Only pay for what you need. I've already seen this ad. I've seen this, this like the past back. couple days. Start yours at PurdueGlobal.edu. The wheels on the bus go round and round. Wow, he's watching Coco Melon. A 16-year-old like him watching Coco Melon. How funny. Exactly. You're 16 years old and you're too and you're still watching these shows. But I don't want new clothes. I wanted to stay here and watch more of these songs. They're the best songs in the whole wide world. Alan, don't get me started with this childish behavior. You need to have new clothes, and that's one of the reasons we're going to the mall. Also, if you behave yourself, we can take you to Pizza Hut, Carl's Jr., or whatever restaurant you want to choose when we're done shopping. You know what? I like that idea. All right then. Why don't you turn off the TV and then we get into the car? All right, kids. Now that we're here, let's do some shopping. First, we're going to JC Penney. Oh look, a kitty train just arrived. Oh my goodness, mom. 
Tony, I would like to take a ride on the train first. <laughs> oh my god, you're too old and too big for the kitty train. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea to go on the train. We have to run some errands. And is there another reason? <laughs> I also think you're too old to ride the kitty train, and you're old. Duh, because it's a toy. It's a it's a and toy wooden train, so you're definitely too and big and you're, you're too big and too old for that. To ride the kitty train. Oh no! Here we go again. Here we go again, we as Tony says. <laughs> yep, Tony was right. He's throwing a tantrum. <laughs> Seriously? That is especially embarrassing. Now, we need to buy you some We have to run more errands. We don't have all day to deal with your childish behavior, you know. But I want to go on the kitty train. I want to go on the kitty train. You're not going on the train because, number one, we're only here to do some shopping, which I think will take until the afternoon to get done. And number two, you're too big and you're too old to go on that train because it's for young children. Yeah, I just said that. You're too big and too old to go on the train. I just said that. <laughs> and he's dead. He's throwing a tantrum on the floor. <laughs> I want to ride the train. Please, both of you are entitled carrots. Entitled carrots. Ellen, don't call me an entitled carrot. That is not very nice. Now. Get up off the floor so that we can do our shopping here at the mall. My goodness, this is really getting embarrassing. Totally embarrassing. I'm only 13 years old, and I don't ride the kitty train at the mall. And in particular, I know better than to throw tantrums whenever I don't get what I want. Exactly. That's just the way things are in this world. Tony is right. I have to agree with you, Tony. That's how, yourself, that's how everything goes. Person, Tony, you're embarrassing me. And basically everyone in the mall. The world don't revolve well, around you. I have to agree with what Tony said. At us. My goodness, a teenage boy acting like a toddler in public? He should be ashamed of himself. How dare she call me a toddler? I am not a toddler. I'm 16. You're clearly acting like a I'm toddler. <laughs> oh, well. Because she called me a toddler. Well, if you were well you're embarrassing, embarrassing everyone in public, so that's no why I got called that. to us and make comments on your behavior. Now, get up off the floor before things get... And the worse. train just left without you. Sorry, buddy. Shopping. Maybe next time. Okay, Mom and Tony. But first, I wanted to go on the kitty train. It just left without you, I buddy. I want to tell you this, but the train already left. Now, let's head over to J.C. Penny. I have a really good feeling that it's going to be even more embarrassing when we're at J.C. Penny. Oh, it's going to be more embarrassing, trust me. You could have dinner with anyone. Ugh, I hate when these ads pop up. Yeah, I mean, it's one thing if an ad pops up during a sports game because that makes sense because especially when they need to substitute players, but on YouTube it makes no sense at all. I mean, we gotta watch these videos. I, I, I can't watch videos without this happening or movies. This is stupid. Okay, back to the video. Oh boy. You're too old for that t-shirt. Yeah, except everyone's going to make fun of you for wearing a Coco Melon t-shirt because you're 16 years old and you're too old to watch that show. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Alan, did you find what you were looking for? Yes, I did. I wanted this Coco Melon t-shirt and it will fit me perfectly. <laughs> yeah, right. We're not buying you that Coco Melon shirt, even though it's your size. Why not? We explained to you many times, we don't want to have to tell you again. But you're yeah, too you're old too for old Coco for. Melon, and you don't want people making fun of you at school. Because exactly. Coco people are going to make fun of you at school if you wear that shirt to school. I want you to buy me the Coco Melon Because you're 16 years old and you're too old for that shirt. Even I know that. I'm too old for that show, honestly. Also, I never even watched that show growing up, and I, and I never even heard of it until now. I didn't even know that was a show till now, to be honest, because I never watched it growing up. 
we're not going to buy you the Coco Melon t-shirt. So why don't we look for other t-shirts instead? Besides, we also have to get you new pairs of jeans. I suggest you put that back wherever you found it. <laughs> as expected, as predicted by Tony, it's going to get more embarrassing. You have already embarrassed us with your behavior. Now please put this He's already embarrassing them again, it. as usual. <laughs> buy me the t-shirt and he's dancing on the floor. <laughs> Is it that complicated? <laughs> no! No! And she just said no using Catherine's voice. Nice. I'm getting you that t-shirt. Especially with the way you are acting right now. And that t-shirt is for babies. Now stop throwing your childish tantrums, or we're going to get thrown out of the store, and we're not going to take you to any restaurant for lunch. <laughs> Here comes the motor car cry. Wow, 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 wow. Just. It. It's one of the funniest Please motor car cries Please I have ever heard. And here comes security. You're in trouble. But are you this boy's family? Yes, I am his mother, and this is his younger brother. Well, I heard this boy's tantrums in the main part of the mall about 15 minutes ago, and I heard him. You're in trouble. <laughs> in J.C. Penny, just now. This is not acceptable behavior. Exactly. I'm going to have to ask you all to leave the mall within the next 30 minutes. Come on, Alan. We are going home, and you're going to be grounded. I don't want to go home. 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 And this is what happens when you throw a tantrum out in public. Yeah. Alan, I here comes the running gag again. <laughs> stop it. Just stop it. <laughs> Another running gag. <laughs> Alright, next video I'm going to react to. Let's see. Childish teenager wants to go to Chuck E. Cheese's. <laughs> And this will be the last video I react to for this video. Oop, hang on, let me fix the brightness. I do apologize. Coming up at 3.30 on Cartoony Toe, a full hour of Coco Melon, followed by Super Simple Songs. Stay tuned. I love watching Coco Melon, my absolute favorite show in the whole wide world. And I get to sing my favorite songs while watching Coco Melon. But I also like to watch Wonder Pets, Paw Patrol, Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood, and Barney and Friends. If only that show didn't get canceled in 2010. Yeah, Barney, I hate. I hated that. Sh Barney along with Caillou, I hated those shows growing up. I'm not gonna lie. The only Caillou videos I like, and it's a viral series on YouTube that I've seen since 2013 or 14, whichever year it came out. I believe it was 2013. Is the Caillou gets grounded series. It's funny as hell. Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood, though, I loved. I loved that show. I also loved watching Wonder Pets. And then, as for um, what's the other show he said he liked watching? Paw Patrol. I didn't watch during my childhood because it wasn't around during my childhood. I mean, it didn't come out until I was a teenager, so I never got to watch that show. I've heard of Paw Patrol, though, and I've heard how, I've heard how good it is. Alan, can you please come downstairs? In 30 minutes, we are going to be having dinner at a restaurant. We're going 
going to Olive Garden because Tony won a first place prize in the science fair this week. Nice, congratulations. Congratulations, Tony. At home all of the time is really boring. However, I think we should go to Chuck E. Cheese's instead of Olive Garden. <laughs> You're too old for Chuck E. Cheese's. Go to Olive Garden. You're too old for Chuck E. Cheese's. Here we go again, like Tony says. I'm 13 years old, and I don't go to baby restaurants anymore. Neither do I. That's one of the reasons I used to go to Chuck E. Cheese's when I was little. When I was little, though, those were the golden days. We should go to one that isn't specifically for babies and toddlers. Alan. We're not going to Chuck E. Cheese's because we're going to Olive Garden instead. Besides, aren't you rather too old to go to Chuck E. Cheese's? You're 16 years old. But I don't want to go yeah, to Olive Garden. Oh, we That's got the echo, boys. Boy. No arcade game. No kiddie train. No coke and melon toy. Why don't we go to Chuck E. Cheese's instead of Olive Garden? Chuck E. Cheese's is the best restaurant in the world. Now, Alan... Don't get us started with your childish behavior. We need you to behave your absolute best while we're at Olive Garden. Otherwise, you'll be grounded. Understand? <laughs> yeah, why can't you take me to Chuck E. Cheese's instead of Olive Garden? Is it that complicated? Is it that complicated? We can go to an arcade place another time, but today... We are going to go to Dave and Buster's. Dave and Buster's is the adult you version of Chuck E. Cheese. I love garden. Dave and Buster's. There are places other than Chuck E. Cheese's that serve pizza. Don't you know that? This is not looking good. No. Nope. It's going to be really embarrassing. While it's. We're out tell of me home. about it, Tony. It's going to be really I embarrassing, but be funny at the same time. Pizza at home instead. I wanted to go to Chuck E. Cheese's. I want to go to Chuck E. Cheese's. I wanted 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 to go. Well, to if Chuck you like Chuck E. Cheese's so much, why don't you go get a job there, Tony? I mean, I mean, sure, you're too old to go and play games there because you're a teenager, but you're not too old to get a job though. You're 16 years old and you're old enough to get a job, so you could get a job there. I mean, I'd be. I mean, it'd be cool. It'd be cool to work at Chuck E. Cheese's since it is a nice arcade. I wanted to go to Chuck E. Cheese's. Please, why can't we go to Chuck E. Cheese's instead of the silly Olive Garden? That the has silly no Olive Garden. <laughs> Olive Garden is not silly. Olive Garden is awesome. I love it. I love Olive Garden. They got one of. They serve one of the best pasta. We are not going to Chuck. They serve one of the best pasta at that restaurant. Final. Now, stop acting like the big baby you're acting like right now. So that we can go to Olive Garden, and I want you on your very best behavior at dinner. Hey, don't call me a big baby. A big I'm baby. You're I'm clearly a big baby, Al. I'm not a baby. I'm not a baby. I'm, I'm not, not a baby. baby. I'm not a baby. I'm not a baby. You're clearly a baby. You entitled Catherine. Otherwise, entitled Catherine. Big time. I love how he calls his own mother an entitled Karen and an entitled Catherine. I just love it. You know what? <laughs> What, Tony? I really think it's a better idea that we have pizza at home instead. It's going to be really embarrassing to have to deal with. No kidding, it would be embarrassing. While we're at Olive Garden, and we may be asked to leave because of it. I'm thinking the exact same thing. We should have pizza here at home instead. Alan, we are going to have to have pizza here at home. We can't go into public places with you acting this way. No, I wanted to go to Olive Garden. I want to oh, go to God. Olive Garden. I want to go to First you want to go to Chuck E. Cheese's, now you want to go to Olive Garden. Wow. <laughs> to Olive Garden. I, I want to go to Olive Garden. I want to go to Olive Garden. Well, so much for you so much for you saying you want to go to Chuck E. Cheese's, now want to go to Olive Garden when you didn't want to go in the first place. So much for it. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> No! No! <laughs> I love when she says no in Catherine's Instead, voice. That's just we're funny. Going to be ordering a pizza to no! <laughs> Motor car cry! Wah, 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 
Oh my god, I just laughed so hard that I just coughed. Oh my god. That was worth it though. It's one of the funny this is one of the funniest videos I've ever seen of somebody acting childish on YouTube. <laughs> oh my god. I'm laughing so hard that I'm coughing. Ugh. Alan, go to your room for thirty minutes. I will let you know when the pizzas are here. <laughs> He's running off to his room crying. <laughs> Down by the bay, where the watermelons Oh, and he's eating Back pizza and watching Coco Melon. Go, nice. For if I do, my mother will say, Did you ever see a dog dancing on a log? Down by the bay. I cannot get enough of Coco Melon, especially now. You that clearly can't, Alan. Pizza while watching these videos. Alright, it's the end of the video.